The vice president touching on the growing number of cases during a stop in Ohio. He was in Lordstown for the unveiling of a new electric truck at the former GM plant there. Station Ken was uh, there and has the interview that you'll only see right here. Unveiling the new endurance, a celebratory atmosphere in Lordstown, Ohio, but a different tone behind the scenes as Vice President Mike Pence offered his take on the growing number of cases. As the head of the White House Coronavirus Task Force, do you believe that increase is due to increased testing? Or do you think the people are not taking this threat as seriously? At this point, uh, we believe that, uh, that much of the new cases is a result of the fact that we're nearing 30 million tests having been done in this country. His focus also right now, policing reform, holding listening sessions with law enforcement and African-American community leaders. We can make real progress, but we don't have to choose between supporting law enforcement and supporting our African-American community. The vice president says meaningful change will be found in common ground, not in violent protests. There's no excuse for what happened to George Floyd in Minneapolis and justice will be served. But there's also no excuse for rioting and looting in, in the name of protest or the destruction of property or the destruction of monuments. He says that destruction is taking away from important conversations about the real issues impacting African-American communities every day. It's absolutely essential uh, that as we look for ways to come together as a nation to improve public safety, to address real issues and inequities in the African-American community, that we also reject those uh, who would exploit the debate over, over real issues for the purpose of, of attacking America, uh, desecrating our monuments, or, or trying to erase our history from our communities. The vice president points to communities like Youngstown, where policing reform is happening in conjunction with African-American community leaders. We're talking about difference in the use of force and de-escalation tactics. In Lordstown Station Aken, ABC6 News. Hi, Bob Kendrick along with Station Aken. Thanks for checking out the WSYX ABC6 YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more Central Ohio news, click on the right to subscribe to our channel and download the WSYX ABC6 app for breaking news alerts. And we'll see you on ABC6 News at 5, 6, and 11. Thanks for watching.